How we doing guys? Welcome back to 6-2 Beer Reviews. Checking out beer I've been very excited um, to check out. Been sitting in my fridge for about a week now. Picked it up in Asheville. This is from Trillium. Citra Cutting Tiles. Um, so I guess Cutting Tiles is a series that they do, from what I understand. Um, this is a double IPA with raw wildflower honey. 8.5% brewed in Massachusetts. Um, Boston, I do believe. Brewed and canned. Canton, Massachusetts, and Boston. Where's Canton? Huh. Um, first beer from Trillium. I was not expecting to find this. Um, like, we never get it where I am, so very cool. Very happy I was able to find this. Label art, I mean, killer. Really awesome label art. Love it. Um, yeah, super excited to check this out. This was canned on September 25th. So we are a little over three weeks old. Still super fresh. I'm assuming it's a hazy. Most of the stuff I see from Trillium is hazy. So, oh man, I can smell it already. We use our Taiku glass because it is a little bit bigger of a beer. I am very, very excited for this. Um, they had a few options at this, uh, at the play, the bottle shop that I went to. Um, they had like two or three trillion beers. Um, but yeah, this is the one sounded good to me. Can't go wrong with Citra either. So looks, um, beautiful. It's not like super turkey gravy, hazy. It's got that like just pretty, um, what do you call that? Just like golden, obviously hazy. Can't see anything through it. Um, didn't pour too much of a head. Kind of got what a about a half finger. Pretty creamy, bone white head. Um, yeah, it looks beautiful. Great looking beer. I can smell it from here. Seriously. So, show my nose in it. See what's got. Yeah, smells like citra. Um, I do feel like I get a little bit of like floral note. It doesn't smell too sweet. I'm sure between the ABV and that honey in there, it's gonna be a little bit sweeter of an IPA. It, it does smell like slightly like malty, um, like caramelly with that higher ABV bumped up in there. Um, but for the most part, I mean, I get straight citra. It is nothing but citrus, it's juicy, juicy orange, um, lemon, a little bit of grapefruit. And yeah, I do get a little bit of like a floral vibe in there. Um, I mean, it smells really solid. But it does, it, like they say citra. I mean, it smells like citra is the only um, hop in here. It doesn't, it's not one of those beers that smells like um, you know, just like, it's kind of everywhere. This beer is like straightforward. It is Citra. Like if you ever had Citra, this is what it, what Citra smells like. It smells great. It does smell like a little bit bigger of a beer, but let's dive in. Cheers guys. Okay, okay. Yeah, this is, this is haze. It is, I mean, there's no, one thing I do love about it, I was expecting just with, um, you know, hazies nowadays, you usually get like a little bit of hot burn in there. There's no hot burn whatsoever. This is super pillowy, super creamy juice. That's what this tastes like. It's also not as sweet as I was expecting. I was expecting like pretty malty caramel sweetness. Um, but this honestly tastes like a six and a half percent IPA. It does not drink like eight and a half. I mean, this, this is really solid. 
I wouldn't say it's like something I would love to have all the time. It's just not exactly my style, but you know, I see Trillium at a bottle shop. I gotta pick it up, um, having never had it before. But I mean, if, if you like hazies, you should love this beer. This is a really well-made hazy IPA. Yeah, with honey, with IPAs, it, it's hard to like really pick it out for me. I feel like it's just one of those adjuncts that you add to beer, at least IPAs, that it's kind of hard to pick it out. But I do feel like it adds just a slight floralness in there that just mixes really well with the beer. I mean, super drinkable for eight and a half percent, like almost dangerously drinkable. I mean, you get a little bit of sweetness in there, but for the most part, it is that same just really juicy, creamy, pillowy. I don't even want to say it's like really fruity. What is it? It just, it drinks. God, I can't even. Flavor wise, I'd, I'd probably say like a, reminds me of like a pineapple Dole Whip, that kind of thing. It's not super orangey. I do get some orange in there. Some lemon, yeah, like a lemon, like a, if there was such thing as like a lemon floral pineapple bowl lip, that's what this tastes like. Yeah, really, really well made beer. Um, I checked out on Untapped, great ratings, as a lot of their beers are. Um, definitely one of those hyped breweries for sure. And I mean, that's cool. It's cool to, um, finally get a chance to try some from them. It's definitely on my bucket list breweries to visit for sure. Um, whenever I, I will make it to Trillium and to Boston. Um, and I look forward to whenever that day is, but yeah, it's for the beer. Really, really solid. And I can say, I can see the hype around them. Um, yeah, it, it doesn't drink like most hazies I've had. I mean, it's got similarities, you know, as a lot of hazies do, but it does have this distinctive flavor to it. Um, and it's cool. Yeah. Citra Cutting Tiles from Trillium. If anybody's had this beer, please let me know. Um, I'm interested to see what, what y'all think. And um, yeah, if you like what you're seeing, hit that subscribe button. Give me a like and, um, you know, I'll see you next time. Cheers.